Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For fast and the cheapest coins anywhere, make sure you guys check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Zerk's going at you today with another Madden Ultimate Team video and today I'm going to be going over the playoff promo. Now I do want to let you guys know that this promo is three parts, okay? And just going to let you guys know right now, the part one, you're going to be upset about it, okay? It doesn't look good. Now they did also showcase us some Team of the Year player nominees uh, early which that voting is going to be open at midnight i will be dropping a video tonight at midnight going over my personal picks but i'm gonna let you guys know which ones i like other ones they also revealed now i don't give a shout out to brayden metry for being a part of the noti gang if you guys want a chance to shout out the next video drop a like in the vid make sure you guys are sub to the channel to notification blonde and comment down below noti gang and also if you guys have not already checked out underdog fantasy you can use code zerk to match your first deposit up to 100 dollars i did already tweet out my nba picks for tonight but also there is the special for this weekend with Stefan Diggs over under one receiving yard so it's pretty much like a free line unless he doesn't get a catch somehow so definitely check that out you can mind that with one other thing and earn three times your money or if you want to do you know five picks and you know you pretty much only have to get four right because the Diggs one is essentially a free pick unless something crazy happens there not a bad idea check out Twitter I did already put my personal five pick that I'm running as well and you can only use one special throughout the entire playoffs but there are going to be additional specials like next week the week after that leading up to the super bowl so if you don't want to do the digs one you don't have to but check it out in the playoff promo now i do also want to let you guys know that there are going to be additional reveals tonight but of course right the mcs stream is currently going on so if you have not already seen it okay if you're not already like signed up and you're not watching the stream right now to get the free 95 Ramsey, the first one that you need is at 30 minutes of watching the stream. The second one is at three hours. You need three total tokens to get Jalen Ramsey. So go over to Twitch, turn on the stream, go over to connections and connect your EA account with your Xbox or PlayStation, whatever, and start watching the stream because it's on right now starting at seven. And I believe it's going to be on until about 10, maybe a little bit after that. Get out. They're going to be doing more reveals on the stream. I believe they're actually going to reveal the champions for the promo. And I don't know when that's going to be. You know, that could be 40 minutes from now, an hour from now, whatever. So I'll just hit you guys with another video later tonight if they're even decent. If not, I'll combine it with the team of the year at midnight. But predictors, you guys have been looking at this for a while now. The playoff promo predictors. Yes, we have predictors with the playoff promo. So I'll go over that. Uh, kind of cool stuff. You know, it's just like free coins. So pretty cool right there. Now getting into the players. Boomski, we have 88 overall. Quentin Jefferson here, 86 speed, 91 excel, 88 strength. 85 finesse move i love rg okay but he started off this stream by saying boomski for an 88 overall uh left end that's not good so yeah quentin jefferson uh michael gallup they did him dirty absolutely did him dirty 91 speed 88 deep route running disgusting how bad they did my guy michael gallup ronald darby 92 speed 93 excel 85 man coverage uh we got ryan suck up 89 kick power 83 kick accuracy jerry hughes 86 speed 90 excel 90 block shed and 90 finesse move we got joe flacco with 95 throw power and uh 78 speed on him so joe flacco cool Le'Veon bell 93 speed is really surprising for a 90 overall Le'Veon Bell with 94 excel, 91 change of direction, 81 catch, 90 break tackle, and he's a receiving back. To be honest, this Bell is kind of one of the better cards in the promo, and that's kind of bad to say. We also get Adrian Amos, a 92 speed and 92 excel, 89 zone, 85 hit power. Uh, we got Danny Trevathan, who approved of a 92 overall middle linebacker with 87 speed, 81 block shed, and 83 zone. I don't know. That's terrible. 92 Adam Thielen, 92 speed, 90 catch and traffic, 92, 89, 87 for the route running. And then we have 92 Keanu Neal with 92 speed and 94 excel, 85 zone, 92 hit power. Uh, we have Raheem Mostert, 94 speed, 95 excel, 93 change direction, 85 break tackle. And onto the 94s. And also you'll notice a lot of these 94s, they're uh, just in general, the, the players from like release one of this promo, just very odd right Corey littleton 90 speed 93 excel 90 block shed on him we have taylor luan with 93 strength 94 pass block 91 run blocking we have 94 jerry cook with 92 speed 92 catch and traffic 94 spec catch 90 short 92 medium and 74 run blocking on him jadevion Clowney. EA, you really made a Jadavion Clowney card just mid. That is terrible. 88 speed, 92 excel, 90 strength, 94 block shed, and 91 power move with only 80 finesse move. 
I don't know how you take a player that everybody gets super excited for every single year and make the card to where no one really wants it, but you did it. We got Marquise Brown with 95 speed and 94 deep route running. Only 83 catch and traffic, though, but he's got the speed for the Ravens theme team for sure and the route running there. Uh, 94 Gilmore, 93 speed, 94 Excel, 94 man, 90 zone, 94 press. And then an LTD that we're going to have tomorrow, guys, is 97 Johnny Unitas. Now, this is the first quarterback that's going to get Hot Route Master, Gunslinger, and a skate artist. That is pretty crazy. Now, you will have to power him up, I believe, to get that because you need to have him at a 98 overall. But if you do so, then he's going to be able to get all of those in his last three buckets because he's actually got four abilities at a 98 overall, and those last three are tier threes. So he will have Howard Master, Gunslinger, and a skate artist, but it's going to cost you 11 AP to get all three of those. And on top of that, guys, he has the Tim Tebow release, which is the second worst in the game. So... Uh, interesting 87 speed 96 throw power he's also got 95 short 95 medium 96 deep and 91 throw under pressure and then we have the predictors and the kickoff sets so for the sets for a 94 you have to exchange two 92s and 188 to get the 94 in their power up for a 92 overall you have to change two 90s and 188 for a choice of 192 overall 288s, 185 to 86 for your choice of 190, and 385 to 86s, and 183 to 84 for your choice of 188. And as I said, we don't know the actual like champion players yet because they're going to reveal those. They didn't show us that set either, but I believe they said you have to add in. I don't want to say it incorrectly because I don't remember exactly, but I think they said 394s, I want to say, and you get them all back as NCAT. I could be wrong, so just wait until tomorrow, we'll see. But then for the predictors, so you guys will get some predictor tokens from completing objectives, and with those, you can add them into these sets here. Now, of course, right, these sets go live tomorrow, and the games start on Saturday, so you don't really have a lot of time to get the tokens, so like for week two and week three of the promo, you know, I'd imagine you'll have more time to go and get those, but you can add them to these sets here, you know, you can put as many as you want into whatever team, or you can spread them around, whatever you want to do, but if they win, it quick sells for 10,000 coins. If they lose, you get a 1,000 coins. So, kind of interesting there. We also do have training rolls, which, of course, yes, Johnny United should be in these. 88-plus playoff and 94 overall playoff player. So, I'll probably do a pack opening in the afternoon doing the 88-pluses to see how good they are. We also have some solos, which you do get a 93 overall Leonard Floyd. Now, I believe his abilities, I want to say, will cost a total of 4 AP, if I remember correctly. He's got 89 speed, 92 excel, 90 block shed, and 93 finesse move. Now, he does get every single nfc team cam so kind of cool there every single nfc team cam the solos are pretty easy you know gain 20 yards in three plus plays or three plays not that hard and then here are those objectives to get the tokens for predictors so get 500 yards 250 passing yards 150 rushing team tackles really not that hard we also have uh this we have a house rules which is just overtime rules simple as that just regular overtime now at 50 wins you get a 94 overall i believe ncat hero and then at 100 wins you get an 88 plus auctionable now into the team of the year so they did show us some early team of the year players right now with the strong safety and free safeties here i believe that it's going to be you know just one more than likely that you guys get to vote on now i will let you know when it comes to who i am going to pick i'm going to share with you guys who i'm going to pick now you guys can do with this information whatever you want i am not forcing you guys to pick any single player okay I'm just simply going to tell you who I think would be potentially the best card here. And also, I'm kind of like a mix of, okay, this player deserves an upgrade and also would be good. I will say, for the strong safety, I'm probably going to go Javon Holland. I think Javon Holland would be a really, really good card. And for free safety, I'm probably going to go Jeremy Chin. I love Jeremy Chin cards, and I think Holland... I think he only has like a 74 overall base rookie card like he doesn't have an upgrade right now and out of all those cards it's probably him and amos that would be the better cards but i feel like holland would be really really good so i'm gonna go with probably holland and jeremy chin tonight at midnight and then for the quarterbacks we have herbert mac jones Derek carr and lamar jackson I'm probably going to go with Lamar Jackson because I think he's going to be pretty glitchy. Now, I don't know the overalls of these cards, and that does kind of matter. Now, I like Herbert, but the thing is, Herbert has the uh, worst release in the game, if you didn't know. And Lamar Jackson has Slinger 4, which is actually kind of one of the 
better releases. It's not the best, but it's a decent release on him. I know some people kind of want to go like Mac Jones, Derek Carr, but I'm going to go with Lamar. He should be able to get Gunslinger if they make him, you know, 95 overall, I believe. If he gets 95 throw power as well, which I fully expect him uh, to be at least 95 overall, and hopefully, you know, they'll make his throw power good too. If they're not going to make these guys 96s, I have no idea what their overalls are. And if the wide receivers, I'm guessing you probably get to pick two. So you have Justin Jefferson, Debo, Deontay, Tyler Lockett, Chris Galvin, and Jalen Waddle. I'm going to be honest, I'm going to go with Justin Jefferson and Debo. I like both of those players. I like both of those cards. I wouldn't be mad if, you know, Deontay or Waddle won it, though. Or, it, honestly, I don't really care who wins necessarily with the wide receivers because I feel like they'll all be pretty good cards. I think the worst one would probably be Godwin. But I'm going to go with Debo and Justin Jefferson as well as Lamar there more than likely. And that is it. So, as I told you guys, there will be some more reveals later tonight. So, I'll probably make a video shortly here. And, you know, it'll be up going over the heroes. If they're bad, I'll just combine it and throw it into the midnight video with you guys uh, for Team of the Year. So, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. And if you did, make sure you guys drop a like and video. And of course, if that's the button down below, I can already tell the comment section, you guys are going to have fun. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time.